Hello, 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 Lidia. Good evening. Good evening. How was your day? Uh, all good. A little busy, but nice. All right. You, you, you're sick? What, what do you get? You said that you're sick? No, a little busy. How do you say it? Oh, busy. Okay, yeah, busy. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. I misheard. Uh, all right, yeah. So you're busy right now, or you, like, no, like that day? No, I with... was. Oh, okay. All right. So you work a lot. Yeah. What, what do you do for? Um. Oh no, you have your own business, right? Yeah, I have my own. That's good. So you don't have nobody on top of you. Huh? You don't have anybody on top of you. So you don't have like, you know. A manager or anything? No, like, no. All right, that is good. Okay, hold on. Let me. I am my own my own manager. You're your own manager. That's right. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Just logging my, linking my PC with the, you know, the WhatsApp group. I mean, with my cell phone. All right. So, uh, let's see who else is here. Uh, welcome, David, Armando, Ellie. All right, nice seeing you here. How was your day, guys? All good? Super good. Really, really good, guys. Very good. Okay, guys, so we're going we're gonna to continue where we left off last time. All right, guys, did you finish? Uh, so we're going we're gonna to solve the exercises together, guys. But I do want you to ask me um, question, questions about them, okay? So I, I want you like if you, I mean I can I will will get the answers here, but I want you to tell me if there is um something that you might have a doubt about, okay? So, pull it out here. So how how do you feel? How do you feel the uh the exercise, guys? Hard. It, it was hard. Yeah. All right. Okay. But did you complete it? Did you did you get a 10? No yet. No yet? Who's talking? I'm not sure who's talking. <laughs> I did it, but everything is wrong. <laughs> okay. All right. You did it, but everything is wrong? Yeah. Wow. Okay. All right. We're going to see that. All right. We'll, we'll see, guys. We'll see. Okay. All right, guys. So let me share the screen with you, and we'll figure it out together. Okay. All right, so we gotta finish this part soon, guys. So, all right, so let's check it out, guys. Okay, so the first one, okay. So I want you to give me the answers, okay, and we'll explain why, okay. So David, I want you to tell me what answer you have here. Yeah, the first one, right. Yeah. So it's appropriate to talk about politics at school or, or uh, well, at work or, or school, right? So what answer do you have here? So my answer is talking about politics at work or school is appropriate. Okay, talking about politics at work or school is now, guys, the thing, the thing about this, guys, First of all, guys, what is your idea behind this? Do you think that it's appropriate or inappropriate? What do you think? It's inappropriate. It's inappropriate, right? Yeah. So there is a there is a there is an error here, guys, because it should be is inappropriate. Okay, so it goes it goes like this: inappropriate. But the structure, David, all right, is good. So yeah, but it's wrong. But kudos for you guys. Kudos for you. Um, all right, so let's see where my oh the. The spelling of inappropriate, okay, it should be like this. And there is, guys, I uh, remember that you have to use the right punctuation, right? So let's see. All right, so what is wrong here? Can you Talking see? about politics at work, okay, at work or school is inappropriate. Oh, I, I see what the, the, what the mistake is. We have two... Uh, two periods at the end. <laughs> All right. 
See guys, if you make, all right, see? Okay, so the, the so David, applause for David, guys, because it was good, except that, you know, the platform had it like the other way around, right? But Very why good. is it growing? Good. You didn't get it? <laughs> yeah, but it's growing. <laughs> okay, all right, I think, okay, so who can, it, so David, all right. So the answer, the answer is, talking about politics at work or school is inappropriate. Is inappropriate, yes. Okay, and what do you have? Because uh, you, told me you said that it is appropriate, right? Remember, capitalization and also the peers, guys. Uh, the platform is very sensitive. Yes, I have a comment, not a peer. <laughs> okay, hold on, guys. Let me just send a message real quick to the group. Okay, it's okay now. <laughs> all right, all right, yeah. Hold on, guys. I'm going to send a message to you all. Wait a second. All right. Very good, guys. So uh, let's continue then. Guys, did you, did you get the message I just sent? Um, I just sent on the WhatsApp group. Yes, yes, yes. No. Nope. David, did you get it? My cell phone is charging. All right, all right. So you don't have it around. Okay, guys. Very good. Okay. So what about what about number two, guys? Uh, let's go, Lydia. Help me read, and then. Let's figure out the answer for number two, according to uh, to what you have. Um, I didn't do it because all day I was not at home, so I didn't. Okay. All right. What do you think the answer is, though? So do my favorite, Lydia, and let's do it right now. But uh, tell me, what do you think the answer is? So read it. Okay, read it aloud, and uh, tell me what do you, what do you think the answer is. Okay, using certain, how do you say that word? Certain. Cert, y el, uh, the Cert, other? Certain, it's like cert, certain. 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 Uh-huh. Gestures. Gestures. Gestures is impolite in some foreign, how foreign. do you say? Foreign. Foreign countries. Countries, there you go. Hmm? All right, so let's try to figure this one out. Okay, let me think. Okay, let me. I am not sure. It's just try, just try. It's okay if you make a mistake. It's okay. I, I want you okay. to. I want to see how 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 well you understood the topic. So, okay, let's, let's try it. Mm -hmm. Let me see. It's impolite. Uh huh. To use. To use. Sir, mm, how do you say that word? I don't. I don't know. All right, you have, okay, so it's sir, okay, sir, and then sir, mm, right, you have to touch your, you have to pronounce the letter, the, the consonant T, right, but you, you do not let go of that, okay, so you say certain, certain, right? Certain. Very good, right? like that, yes, certain. Gestures in some foreign countries. Okay, everybody go, everybody, gestures, repeat, gestures. 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 Gestures, okay, all right. All right, it is impolite to use certain gestures in some foreign, okay, foreign countries, okay. All right, well, let's see if that's okay. Let's see, and that is absolutely right. Plus for Lydia, good job, Lydia. Good, good, good job, I like it. All right, so Lydia, uh, do my favor, pull out the platform and, and let's complete it right now, okay? Because I, I do need it to complete it. All right, but very good job, Lydia. Lydia, pick someone else. Um, let me see. Armando. 
Armando. Let's go, Mr. Armando. Number three. The answer or I read the first? Uh, you can, okay, I want you to read the, the question. Well, not the question, but the, the exercise and then uh, the answer. Asking someone's age is considered fruit. Okay, all right, so how can we change that? It's often, often considered rude to ask someone's age. It's often considered, very good, considered rude to ask for someone's age, all right? All right, uh, did you say for or did you say to ask somebody, someone's age? To ask someone. Okay, to ask, okay. So it's often, all right, let's say it is, okay. I don't know if it's taken it correctly because of that. It is often considered rude to ask to ask for someone's age. And you say that you only have it like this, to ask someone's age, like that. Is that the yes. Is that your answer? And it, was it correct? It was correct in the platform. Hold on, but it's not giving, like, like it's not coming up as correct for me. It is often considered rude to ask someone's age. Right, what are we missing here? Um, I used to ask, to ask for someone's age and mm -hmm. it gives me it as, it, it says it's incorrect in that way. Okay, all right, but that, that would actually be correct. But right now, I mean, I'm using, it is often considered rude to ask someone's age. Maybe the apostrophe, guys. Sometimes we don't, guys, that's another thing, right? Sometimes you will get errors because uh, we don't use the, the apostrophe. We use another character, which is not the apostrophe, okay? So let me use, let me try to see. This is true. Okay, all right, but I used another one, but didn't come out. Wait. Now this is this is the apostrophe. All right, all right. Well, well, we'll we'll check that out, okay? But that would be okay, right? Well, what do you got? So according to what I have here, what what is what do you see different than what you have? I have it is often considered. I tried it. It's it's often. Well, with, or with the apostrophe. The well, yeah. I mean, it's the same. Uh, so it's often considered rude to ask someone's age. Is that how, how you have it? Oh, oh, okay. All right, guys. This is, okay, this is silly, all right? Uh, use the apostrophe, guys. I mean, you can say it is often considered. It would be okay, right, guys, okay? But the platform is just taking it with the apostrophe. So it's often considered rude to ask, uh, to ask someone's name. I mean, age, all right? Beautiful job, Armando. Good job. Plus, Armando, guys. Good, good, good job, Armando. Very good. All right, Armando, pick your, pick someone else. Pick someone who likes to eat a lot of uh, tamales. Miguel. All right, Miguel. Let's go, Miguel. Well, not much, but... <laughs> <laughs> not much. <laughs> yeah. It's not unusual to... Uh, let's see. Hold it out here better. It's not unusual in the USA to address a professor by his or her first name. Very good, guys. So you can call me David, right? So now, guys, uh, re pr pr pronunciation. Everybody, do my favorite, guys. Remember, ha cameras on, unless they're really not working. All right. Now, pronunciation, guys. Unusual. Unusual. Okay. All right. Unusual. 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 All right. Uh, now, guys, uh, just just a quick tip, guys, real, real quick. Uh, professor, guys, all right, what is the difference between a professor and a teacher? What do you think? Um, all right, guys, uh, teaching that? if you teach children, all right, if you don't, if you're not basically, guys, a professor teaches at the university. All right, a teacher teaches like, like like everywhere else, okay? But if you go to college, if you go to uh, to university, all right, it's called professor, okay? You cannot, for example, you can't call me professor, right? 
I'm not at the university. I'm not, I'm not teaching at the university, right? So in my case, I am a teacher, but when you have like somebody at the university, that's a professor, got it? Here, you know, so, I mean, here in Spanish, guys, you call like professor, like ever since you're in kindergarten, right? Okay, they say, oh, my professor, right? Of course not. <laughs> All right, very good, guys, very good. So, so what, what would be the answer here? Can you get? For what would it be, uh, Ellie? <laughs> it's all right. Uh, I was asking if we, if we can ask that for like a parent. Um, for example, other I mean, I don't know how the right pronunciation, but I mean, yeah. Okay, all right. It's, can it's, we use it's, this it's, it's, it's a bit hard. Them? It's a bit hard to understand because of um, because of the I I don't know your 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 audio is kind of weird. All right, all right, very good, guys. So um, okay, I was asking. Oh well, my God, much better. <laughs> I was asking if we can use that word like a giant. Others, I don't know how to pronounce this word, but <laughs> I want to know if we can that. If we can use that word like an gentleman to say others in a professor by his or her first name is not in notion. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You. Oh, you mean you can. You mean if you can. Okay. I. I think I got the idea. Okay. You mean if you can use it. Yeah. It, addressing. Yeah. Okay. Addressing a professor by his or her name well her first name yeah i mean that is absolutely correct i don't know if the platform would take it as right or right uh, though but it is absolutely correct okay you can say addressing a professor by his or her first name is is what is unusual <laughs> usual. usual well it's not guys right it's not it's not uh, unusual. Repeat, unusual. All right, repeat, guys. Unusual. unusual. All right, it's not unusual in the U.S., right? Okay, so, so tell me, I'm sorry. We don't need to pronounce the middle M. You don't need to what? You don't, you don't need to pronounce uh, what? Uh, to pronounce the letter M. So we, we are saying unusual. Oh, no, no, no. You are pronouncing the, 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 the end consonant. Un, unusual. Yeah. Unusual. Okay. Unusual, okay. All right, very good, guys. So let's see if that is accepted here. All right, so what do you think the, the mistake is here, guys? Addressing a professor by his or her first name is not unusual in the U.S. What do you think? No. What do you think, guys? I mean, it seems correct. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna come back to that later. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, Fatima Campos, number five. Uh, we're we're gonna come but, back to that later. Uh, huh? Okay, I have been trying, but it's incorrect. So I don't know why. Okay, but all right, give me your example. Don't worry. Okay. Uh, Having friends when you with them, it's customary in many cultures. So my answer is, it's customary in many cultures to have friends when you greet them, but greet them, but it's incorrect. In many cultures, to have to what? To hug friends. To hug, yeah. To hug okay. friends when you greet them. Okay. All right. All right. Let's see. Okay, we'll we'll see that. We'll 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 check that out. Okay, but it's correct, guys. Okay, I mean, if you say, try. Have you tried doing it with with um? No, it's correct. Uh, it's uh, hugging friends when you greet them is customary. What well, have you tried to use, guys? Have you tried doing it with um? Uh, starting with infinitive. What do you think? 
it's customary in many cultures to hug friends I when you're greeting. I haven't played with Infinity. All right. All right. We're going to check on that. Box. All right. We're going to check on that too. All right. Number six. What do you think number six is? Oh. I have to send him a minute. Uh -huh. Tell me. Uh -huh. It's inappropriate. It's, it's inappropriate. inappropriate in some country um to ask. Okay. It's inappropriate uh, to ask in some if countries they, if they are married. Okay. Um. In some countries, to what? If they are married. To ask strangers, right? Strangers, if they are married, yeah, married. okay. All right. So, eh. all right, beautiful guys, all of them are correct. No, guys, I mean, all right, so one thing, guys, one thing, okay? The platform is very picky, guys, but the answers are incorrect, okay? So kudos to you. We're gonna see what the actual, um, what the, like how the, you know, the platform wants them to um, answer it, okay so the first one guys in the u.s addressing a professor by his or first name isn't unusual now let me ask you something guys do you think that this is the same thing as this yes or not no no <laughs> not right. yes guys it is it, it has exactly the same meaning okay it has Can exactly I the same meaning so this answer guys addressing a professor by his or first name is not unusual in the US, is exactly what we have here. Addressing a professor by his or first name isn't unusual in the US, right? It is the same thing, guys, right? Uh, but written in a, like written differently, okay? So technically, guys, this should be correct, okay? So if you had it like that, guys, if Fatima, this is absolutely correct. You were absolutely right, okay? But put it like this, guys, okay? Because there is only like one answer. Now there is, there's also in the US, period, and then a comma, and then a space, okay? Don't forget about that, because otherwise it will be correct too, okay? So in the US, in the U, period, S, period, comma, space, addressing a professor by his or first name isn't unusual, all right? Um, uh, <laughs> yeah, guys, you have, to, you have to type it like that, right? Now, same thing here, guys. Uh, you said it's customary in many cultures to hog friends when you greet them, right? It's customary to hug friends when you greet them in many cultures. In many cultures, coma, it's customary to hug friends when you greet them, right? Does it mean the same? Are we using um, are we using infinitives? Yes, right? So it's the same case, the same case. But it is correct, guys. It doesn't mean that you made a mistake. If you if you have it like this, guys, this is actually how it should be. All right. All right, uh, number six, guys, exact, it's exactly the same thing. You said it's inappropriate in some countries um, to what? It's inappropriate in some to countries to ask, to ask strangers if they are married, they are married, right? Married. So if you say, take a look here, it's inappropriate to ask strangers if they're married in some countries, right? Or in some countries, it's inappropriate. All right, uh, in some countries, it is inappropriate to ask strangers if they're married, right? I think the only thing that you're missing here is, um, well, actually, no, this, these are both correct. Both Location. Correct. All right. So um, the only thing that you see here, guys, okay, is that you're actually talking about the object of the sentence at the beginning. But other than that, the structure that you have, guys, is absolutely fine, okay? So again, uh, just put it, just type it in like this. In some countries, coma, it's inappropriate to ask strangers if they're married. Thank you. All right. How are you gonna? What are you gonna do with these guys who are not joined? Who have not joined you? <clears throat> All right. Very good. Okay, so let's uh, let's type in these answers, guys. Okay, 
and uh, they should come out as correct. All right. So it's the same answer that you gave us, guys, but in a different uh, order, all right? Douglas, welcome, Douglas. Nice to see you. All right, guys. So are we good? Did we get them, did we get them all nice correct? Nice to see you, Chich. Yes. Very good job, okay? Um, uh, Lydia, did you get them? All right, um, did you do them? What? Did you do them? <laughs> did you answer them? Yeah. yeah, I am doing. Okay, all right, sounds good. Any questions, guys? Any questions? Um, question, question? No. So far, at the Not platform. So far. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, but you guys are correct, okay? Don't, like, just whatever the, the answer that you gave us. That is the answer that you have to um, to to get. And I'm sorry, guys, but yes, you have to take care of the periods and cap cap uh, capital capital capitalization. All right. All right. Very, very good, guys. So, all right. So, what's today's objective, um, David? Hey. <laughs> what's your What's your um, pick? Someone. <laughs> okay, Fatima Campos. All right, Fatima Campos. All right, Fatima. So, uh, what's the, what's today's objective? In this class, participants will learn and practice using vocabulary to talk about social situations. Social situations, very good job. So let's watch a video, guys, and um, you're gonna dramatize it. <laughs> all right, all right. Take notes, guys, um, and just listen to it. Hi, listen and read the following words and phrases. Decide if they are positive, negative, okay. or... All right, can you hear now? Hi, listen and read the following words and phrases. Yes. Decide if they are positive, negative, or neutral. A compliment, an insult, appropriate, bad form, inappropriate, normal, offensive, polite, rude, strange, typical, unusual. All right, guys, so let me let me serve you right there. Okay, guys, so um, we're going to determine, guys, which uh, which words and phrases, which of, you know, which of these words and phrases are, you know, positive, negative, or neutral, right? Now, let's learn the pronunciation. Everybody, unmute yourselves and repeat after me. Compliment. Compliment. Repeat, compliment. guys, compliment, okay? An insult. An insult. Very good. Appropriate. Appropriate, appropriate. Okay, no, it's not appropriate. Appropriate. I'm, okay, right? Sorry, I, I got an issue with my audio here. Okay, That's right. I didn't hear properly. Very good, very good, very good. Okay. All right, everybody, bad, bad form. Bad form. Okay. Hey, guys, unmute yourself, please, okay? Um, inappropriate. 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 Very good job, very good job. Now remember, guys. Uh, when we pronounce "bad," guys, that that "ah" sound is a cat sound, right? So you have to smile when you say it. "bad form," "bad form," inappropriate, bad form. inappropriate, 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 normal, normal, normal. Offensive. offensive, offensive. Oh, right, offensive. Okay, polite, polite, polite. rude, rude. rude. Or no, 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 it's not rude, rude. Uh, it's just like a very rude. Repeat rude. 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 Very good. Strange. 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 All right, typical. Typical. Unusual. 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 Very good job, guys. So from these guys, okay, like, what do you think are the positive and negative ones? What does our negative forms? Okay, which which of these words or phrases are are positive, and which ones are negative, or in which ones oh, are neutral? Okay. Mm -hmm. um, number two is okay. negative. All right. So number. Okay. Let's let's start from from uh, from from one to twelve. Okay. So let's see, Miguel. Number one, positive, negative, neutral. Positive. Positive, okay, very good job. Lydia, number two, positive, negative, neutral. Um, negative. An insult, very good, okay. Uh, Douglas Serrano, number three, positive, negative, neutral. 
neutral. Okay, no, repeat neutral. 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 Very good job, okay? Yeah. Appropriate, okay, that will be, okay, hold on. I'm gonna just put it like this, guys. I think that will be smarter. Positive, <laughs> negative, and neutral, right? Very good. All right, uh, bad form. Okay, bad form, Armando. What do you think about bad form? Negative. Okay, right, very good job. Inappropriate. What do you think about inappropriate, Ellie? Elizabeth? Negative. Okay, inappropriate is negative, very good job. <clears throat> normal. What do you think about normal? Uh, the, 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 the David, what do you think about normal? I think it's neutral. Yes, it is neutral. Very good job. Offensive. Fatima Campos, offensive. What is it? Negative. Okay, right. Well, it depends, right? If it is your, if it is your, uh, your your mother-in-law. I'm ah, just kidding, guys. All right, it's uh, it's it's negative, right? Polite, guys. Polite. What do you think polite is? Um, positive. Okay, positive, okay. Uh, Miguel Angel, rude. What do you think rude? What, what do you think about rude? Huh? Oh, Miguel Angel is not there. Uh, Lydia, what about rude, Lydia? Lydia, are you there? Negative. Okay, all right, this will be negative. Ruth will be negative, okay? All right, uh, strange, guys. What do you think about strange? Neutral. Neutral. Okay, uh, very good. It is neutral, right? Typical? Neutral. Neutral. Neutral, very good job. Unusual? Neutral. neutral. All right, unusual is neutral, too, okay? Do you know the meaning of all of them? I am not sure yeah. with the... With the first one. First one, compliment. A compliment is when I tell you, hey, you, you are really, really smart. You're the best friend that I can ever, that I could ever have. Um, so that's, that's, uh, that's com a compliment. You are I'm so, it, yeah, no Spanish. <laughs> okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Google Sorry. Translate. <laughs> <laughs> what? It's okay. Google Google Translate, right? No, it's okay. Okay, guys. Oh, wait. All right. So yes, guys. So that is uh, that is a compliment. Okay. Did, did you get and the, the second of a compliment? One? The second one. Uh, you mean an insult? Ah. Uh, an insult is when the like the opposite of a compliment. Yes. Okay. Right. I got okay. it. <laughs> All right. Very good. Very good. Okay. Thanks. All right. What else? What else, guys? Do you, do, you, do you have another one? In bad form. Bad form is to be in bad, a bad, bad form, guys. Uh, By the way. Yeah, it's like saying, it's like saying, you know what? Um, that's a bad form of saying that. It's it's like a bad way, exactly. But this one, guys, I mean, this one is very, like, I don't hear people using this, okay? Oh, that's a bad form, okay? You can say that's a bad, bad form of saying that. All right, but uh, you can say that's a bad way, okay? Let's change this for bad way, guys, okay? Because form, people, like, I don't know, that's old English. All right, what else, you guys, what else? That's it. That's it? Beautiful, yeah. beautiful, beautiful, All right? So let's move on then. All right, let's move on, okay? So. Now, uh, let's 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 see about uh, let's talk about some examples here, guys. Okay, all right. So let's see what is appropriate, what is inappropriate. So with the with the vocabulary that you just learned, okay, you're gonna tell me if this is you're gonna tell me you're gonna give me uh, opinions about uh, about these type of behaviors, okay? So number number one, help me read, that, David. You kiss people, you meet on the cheek. Very good job. You kiss people, you meet on the cheek. So from the vocabulary that you just learned, guys, what is your opinion on you? Okay. So that is what you are going to answer, guys. You're going to answer that, but not with me, guys. You're going to practice right now. Uh, take a screenshot, guys. Send it to the group or just take a screenshot for yourself. 
all right or okay. just simply use the platform right so you're gonna tell me guys so for example let me know when you take the screenshot save me teacher Ready. okay very good did you i'm sorry did you take the screenshot yes yes, yes. yep very good very good, very good okay okay guys so uh so i'm gonna couple you up guys and you're gonna start telling me uh you're gonna start talking about their behaviors right so you're gonna use the vocabulary <laughs> do you want to take a uh, screenshot of the vocabulary you should have written it down guys but take a screenshot if you want so basically guys you're gonna tell me if it is appropriate or inappropriate okay um you know what i think that kissing people on the cheek is inappropriate because uh nowadays we are under this uh really bad pandemic and you could get a disease you know you could get infected if you start kissing people on the cheek so i think for now you know it's inappropriate oh you know what i think it's offensive to kiss people on the cheek because i'm a mean i'm a millennial and i get offended by everything right <laughs> millennial. all right <laughs> Okay, so uh, so I want to hear opinions like that, guys. Do you have any questions on what you're going to do right now? Guys, any questions uh, on what you're going to do? I have a right question. Now? Tell me. <laughs> Are we only going to, uh, to discuss? Are we going to discuss about all the sentences? You're only going to discuss about the sentences. You're going to give your opinion. I want to hear you giving an opinion about about these behaviors so basically the question i want so we have to justify why or not yeah you do have to justify why yes yeah i mean it's a regular conversation i do want to hear you using the vocabulary that we just learned right but you're gonna okay. say okay so basically what do you think about these behaviors right all right, so what do you think about these behaviors? All right, so uh, you kiss people you meet on the cheek. So what do you think about that? Okay, so I don't, I, I consider that kissing people on the cheek is inappropriate because this and this and this and that, right? Uh, you're, you and your classmates interrupt the teacher. I think that interrupting the teacher, um, you know, is incorrect or, or is, is an insult to the teacher because of this and that, yes? All right, very good, guys, very good. All right, so uh, let's get started then. And let's go. That's weird. Okay, all right, let's go, guys. Hello, Armando. Hello. All right, let me hear you guys. Okay, Armando, what is your opinion about uh, about the first one? You kiss people, you meet on the cheek. I think that without a pandemic is really normal. But now a days is inappropriate for both. What do you think about the second one? You and your sorry, teacher, I can hear you. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, right. Uh, I think I think Lydia had uh, lost connection for a moment. With the electricity, so I don't know. It's okay. Uh, Fatima will explain to you what we're doing right now. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Fatima, do you have the do you have the, the screenshot? Yeah. All right. Very good. Very good. So let's go for it. Okay. Um, I had to send the screenshot to the group. No, I'll, I'll send it. I'll send it. Just, it, you, just share the screen with Lady if you want. Okay, just. And I'll send over. Uh, I'll send in the vocabulary as well. 
Okay. Classmate. It's so weird. Everybody's telling me, you know, that, that they're getting, you know, uh, they're having issues with their electricity. Yes, in my case, I, I have problems with my internet connection. Oh, okay. All right, don't worry. It happens. I understand. All right, so let's practice. Yeah. Okay. okay. I'm just going to be listening to you. Okay, Lydia, are you? I, I open it with, with her. And that's it. Uh, tell me your best friend. Calls you over. <laughs> Calls you over 11 p.m. For me, he is kind of typical. Not every day, but some days we talk a little. We talk sometimes. And we pass that time. Okay. Really? <laughs> what do you think about you start a conversation with, with an exchange on the bus or um, or subway? Subway. Um, I consider, especially nowadays, is something inappropriate. Talk with um, someone, someone else, especially, uh, probably he, what? So, um, yes, in my opinion, is something inappropriate because nowadays is, is well, you know, is is what <laughs> is danger outside. You, when you talk with someone strange, probably mm, what <laughs> I don't have an idea uh, with about it, but I consider it something inappropriate, especially in those times. Uh, what about you? What is your opinion about this? Uh, I'm sorry, could you repeat the last sentence? Uh, which one? Uh, could you repeat the last thing that you said? I, I didn't understand what you said. That's why, that's why I'm asking. I, in my opinion, is is inappropriate to talk with someone else, uh, especially on the bus or the subway. Sub Subway. Rapper, Sub uh, 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 right? Oh. Subway, Subway, okay. Subway. Now, now, uh, one thing you have this, this. Um, I want to help you, and so I, uh, you have a big area of opportunity. You are using is. I think is. I think is. I think is. I think is. Right. So don't say I think is. It's. All right. Remember, every time that you're talking in English, you have to use the subject, right? Mm -hmm. I think it is, or I think it's, okay? All right, okay. don't forget about that, okay? But good job, man. All right, Armando, all right, let me hear you, Armando. About the last one. I think that for me it's very unusual to start a conversation with um, a, um, with um, a strange and please in a bus or a subway because I'm very shy. Okay. All right. What else? And I think that if somebody start a conversation with me, I think that it will be difficult for another people, but not for me. But I have to answer like being polite. Okay. All right. All right, good job, good job. All right, very good. Let me check on other groups, guys. Keep continue practicing. Okay.
Emergency. Hello, how are you doing here, guys? Uh, yeah. yeah good. We're doing great. All right, let me hear you. I don't know, see you. Yeah, doing good. Yeah, I'm just, I, was, I was listening to the other guys, uh, so I'm going to listen to you now. Go for All it. All right. Uh, Which one? Nervous is coming. Um, <laughs> you start the conversation with a stranger and both of you, I mean, every time. <laughs> it's kind of even appropriate, but I'm doing every time. Okay, Eli, let me let me help you, okay? I want to help you. Um, mm -hmm. When you're speaking, okay, try to slow down and open your mouth a lot. Like open your open, open your mouth the, your mouth wide when you speak, okay? The reason why is because you speak very fast, so it's hard to understand like that. So okay. what you have to do, okay, you can extend the words. Right now, I'm speaking slow, right? Okay. So, so uh, open your mouth when you're speaking, um, so we can we can understand better. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna be practicing. Okay, I'm going to be, or I'm gonna I'm be going to. I'm going to be practicing. Okay, all right, all right, that's good. Okay, all right, continue. Let me hear you. Okay, uh, I do it every time. I do it every time when I'm going in a bus, a bus, a bus. 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 The bus. bus. Yes, bus. Or, uh -huh. or everywhere. So I'm on the street and I'm, hello. And somebody say, oh, it's hot today. I say, yeah. Uh, where are you? Where do you live? <laughs> Something like that. Okay, hold on. So, you, so, it's kind so, of, so I don't know. Inappropriate, but I do. Okay, okay. So you don't like getting compliments from men when you walk on the street. I don't like that. Okay. No. Well, I agree with. I, I agree with you. I think that it's an. I don't like that. I just. Yeah, okay, inappropriate. I don't like. Okay. Uh, I. Okay, the, the last one, uh, I was talking about the last one. You start, you start a conversation with a stranger on a bus or subway? Bus. I do, even if it, no me esté tirando los perros. I don't know how we say bus. Right, flirting, uh, so that's called no flirting. Say, I'm, flirting. Solo si no me tira flirting. Huh? Yes, flirting. Okay, yeah. only if there is... If, if, only if he or or she or she or she isn't flirting how is flirting okay, okay I have to okay so so here he, he or she I'm, I'm confused okay all right I hear she okay all right now I okay, okay I, I got do it. Less. What, what about you, Douglas? What do you think? Uh, what do you think about it? I am kind of shy and kind of shy and quiet and kind of reserved. I don't usually speak with uh, strange people because that's, I think that's, uh, that's inappropriate because <laughs> we don't know them. But there are certain situations where I have made the exception that I have talked to strange people and mm -hmm. sometimes I am kind of friendly and most of the time when people is really really friendly and they speak to you even when you don't know them and I am friendly too and they speak to you even when you don't know them okay all right very good so uh good examples like me <laughs> like me all right so we're gonna continue guys we're gonna continue right now okay uh let's go back to the main room and we're going to continue okay. from there. Okay. All right. All right, guys. Um, great, great practice. I liked it. Okay. Um, so, guys, did we did we understand, uh, you know, the, the usage of these expressions to comment on behavior? All right. Do they make sense? Yes? No? Right, beautiful, beautiful, yeah. beautiful. 
All right, guys. So before we before we wrap it up, guys, we're gonna take a look at uh, we're gonna do a listening exercise. So everybody, I uh, want you to go to the exercise 1.5, okay? So everybody, go to exercise 1.5, which is the listening exercise, and we're gonna solve the small quiz that we got there. Okay, so it's gonna be this exercise right here, right? So I'm gonna get you together, guys. Um, I'm gonna couple you up. And um, and you're gonna you're gonna solve these, okay? So we have until 9 p.m. to finish them. All right. So 1.5. Any questions? 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 No questions. So far, All right. No, so far. So far, so good. Beautiful. All right. So let's work on it. All right. All right. Very good. Let's go. All right. You think this this is good? There you go. All right, let's go, guys. Hey, Nidia. All right, Lydia. Lydia, are you there? Yeah, I think. Hi. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I was gonna say she she might be having issues with her internet. But we're good. Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's go. Okay. I'm sure if you have access to the platform now, because I, I don't have access to the platform. You don't have access to the platform, Douglas? No. Oh, wow. Have you reported it? No, no. Did you did you check your email? Yes, I have checked my email. And I am going to send a message for the technical support. Okay, sounds good. Um, okay. Right. So, so what is it exactly? Well, well, actually, you know what? Let's work on that later. But let's make sure that we fix the. You know, let me know if something happens so we so I can report it to, to the technical support team. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, meanwhile, let's go ahead and practice. Uh, let's do the I'm exercise. I'm going to share my screen. Very good. There you All go. Right. It's perfect. You've been with me for a long time now, Fatima. Yeah, like four months. Who's been your favorite teacher so far? If you don't me, I'm gonna... Who's been your favorite teacher so far? Well, you, because um, in my second month, I was with another teacher, so I, I decided to change. Oh, okay. Change. All right, that's good, that's good, okay. I'm glad that you're back. <laughs> All right, continue, guys. We good, guys? No problems? No, no problem. Very good. It's very, very slow. Yes, I can see it. Okay, let me see. Mm. Thank you for showing your screen. My internet is very slow. Oh my god, next. Nice. Oh, okay. Okay. Listen to three conversations at a party. Who is speaking in each one? One. Hi, are you Pete? Yes. Oh, I'm Liz Morton. Tom Morton's mother? Oh, right. Nice to meet you, Mrs. Morton. You too. So, are you enjoying the party? Yeah, it's great. This might be the last time I've seen some of these people for a long time, so I'm busy trying to make sure I get a chance to talk to them. You know, it's strange that all you kids are graduating. Do you have any plans after graduation? Well, I don't apply for a pigeon now for six. I guess I'll go to my job. I got a job in the next week. You're more adventurous than Tom. I can't believe he's going to take a job right here in town. But it's a good job, I guess. And of course, I'm missing it when I'm far away. Yeah, I know. My aunt doesn't want me to go far away either. Oh, wait a minute. I'm sorry. I think I have a friend of mine is leaving. Excuse me, Mrs. Boyd. I need to say goodbye. She only knows. Oh, sure. It was great.
aparentemente. Ten. Great music. Listen to three conversations at a party. Great to meet you, Pete. Two. Hey, Jim. Great music. What group is it? I don't know. It's the radio. Maybe they'll say after it's over. Well, it's a good thing my wife isn't here, or she'd make me dance to it. You know, she loves that old-fashioned dancing. Yeah, I know. My wife's the same way. Myself, I haven't danced since my wedding day, and I intend to keep it that way. Yeah, I'm with you. Although I do like this old-fashioned dance music, the bands back in those days could really play. Not like today. It's all image now, you know? Oh, I don't know about that. It's just the style's changed, that's all. I mean, a lot of those pop stars are actually pretty talented. You really think so? Sure. Actually, I've been listening to this CD my grandson left behind at the house last Thanksgiving. It's some of that, what do you call it, that hip-hop music. What? You've got to be kidding me. No, no. A lot of it isn't bad. I mean, at least the lyrics are about something, you know? Mm, I don't know. No, try it. You'll see. Wait, wait, I'll put it on now. I'd rather go out dancing. Anyway, I should get going. I'll call you later. Three. Are we good, guys? Eli, Armando? Yes, teacher. We have finished. That's why we are not talking anymore. We have it, and we have it good, everything. Okay. Uh, all right. Very good. Uh, try to, you know, try to practice when you finish, because, you know, this is, like, the only time you have to practice talking, you know, in English, right? Uh, so try that, but we're going to go back right now. All right. Guys, all right, guys, really good job, guys. Um, so if you didn't finish, guys, the listening exercise, please go ahead and do so after class. Um, aside from that, guys, tomorrow, guys, guys, tomorrow, all right, it is really, really important, okay? You're gonna finish, guys, the platform on your own, all right? You're gonna finish the, the first, um, the first um, section on your own, guys, but tomorrow, guys, we're gonna see a very in a uh, very important topic, okay, which is reported speech. So I really want you to be here, guys, because that's a little bit, com you know, it's it's a, it's not complicated, but but it might be at the beginning, okay. So um, so just be early, guys. Aside from that, thank you very much for joining, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. You have a very good see night, guys. Have a good night. Thank you, guys. Well, thank well, you. So night, thank you.